You conquer the lightweight division. What would it mean to take over the junior welterweight division? Oh, it means everything. I mean, what is the takeover if he doesn't take over the guys that are the kingpin of the division, right? So when it comes to Josh Taylor, junior welterweight, uh, he is the guy. And that's the guy that you got to beat to be the greatest, right? So this is what we aim for all the time. It's gotten nasty at times. Is that genuine or is this just uh, two, two really great showmen promoting a fight? No, I think it's a little bit genuine. You know, he says what he means. Um, I mean what I say as well. And so I got that wrong there. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I, I say what I mean as well. So yeah, ge- there's a little bit genuine just dislike here. Um, he's been disrespectful. So yeah, and a lot of words he said, I'm going to make him pay for on Saturday. So yeah, I can't wait to get in there and get touring amongst them. What do we see Saturday night? Josh Taylor win. That's all. Possibly by KO. Nice and early as well. Big smile. Yeah, man, uh, work my ass off, man. About 11 weeks of camp, this one being 12, but fight week, we don't really count. Um, you know, for me, I think it's just really, uh, the best version of me that I have yet to see in myself. You know, I, I question myself because I know I'm greater and every true artist always does that. We aim for perfection, but there's only one perfect person that's perfect and that is God. So for me, I think it's just practice makes improvement and we've improved since my last fight. And we're ready to put on that show. And I think that we will win, most definitely. And I believe that, uh, you know, I'll be what? Two lineal, two-time world champion. That's dope. Listen, we, we could both go on our uh, previous performances and say, you know, you're only as good as your last fight. But I believe that's a lot of shit. You know, I, I prepared crap for the last fight. So I performed crap. You know, he, I believe he was the same. Takes the eye off the ball. Um, and he, he performed crap as well, you know, so we both got the bit between our teeth here, you know, he's he's up against the king of the division, I know he's a good fighter, the, the version that beat um, Lomachenko is a very good fighter, that's the version that I'm preparing for, so um, it, it's, it's all about your preparation, and this time I've prepared diligently and to the best of my ability, and you'll see the, you'll see the best of me on Saturday night. Fuck yeah, I'm there. Heck yeah, man. I'm excited about this. This is like a a dream come true, turning into reality. I mean, what more can you really shoot for? You know what I mean? This guy, no one really has called out Josh Taylor. Who knows why? Maybe because he beat everybody already. So for me, I'm here. I'm here to come in there and take everything that you got. That's what we are, a takeover. Good. Where what? There's nice and try, good. I can't wait till you come and try. Can't wait. Oh, ain't no trying try. with me, man. Yeah. That's just the thing, though. That's, That's the all thing. it's going to be. It's going to Everybody be. Everybody got a plan until they get punched in the face. Shout out to Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson again. Here we go. Clown. <laughs> you not got any quotes of your own? I do have one. I just made it up yesterday. I think it says, aim for death. <laughs> for that's where life begins. Oh, okay. Wow. No comment. I think it's a good one. You aim at death, for that's where life begins. Everybody's scared of death. I don't know why. We're all going to die. But at least if I die, I'm dying for something that, I, that means something that's going to last forever. It's what greats are all about. Something that you don't really know. This is my seventh year now as a professional and about to be a seven-time world champion within that time frame. I mean, that's great. At 25 years young, I mean, this is what we're all about, man. Remaking history, making history. And giving the fans and giving the kids, the youth, a good thing to follow on. They need that. They need that that um, that motivation to know that they could do it too. The only way you can, there's earth, there's man. And in between that, you bring the realization within yourself from the heavens. <laughs> Champ. You- Listen, at the end of it all, man, everybody can laugh, do whatever the fuck they want. But it's just me and him that's fighting. For me, this is a dream come true, you know, um, fighting in a place like this, topping the bill, bringing the traveling fans over, the Tartan Army's coming over as well. So, yeah, I can't, I can't wait to get in there on Saturday and another dream come to uh, becoming a reality. So, yeah, this is, this is brilliant. And this clown here sitting in my way on Saturday is, is in my way. It's just another piece of cannon fodder. That's all he is. Listen, I'm getting ESPN over there going, let's wrap this up. Mm-hmm.